Born 1935 in the parish of St. Mary, Syringa Marshall Burnett grew beyond the ordinary to live a distinguished life in service to nation building. Her decades of contribution to development as an healthcare professional, educator, parliamentarian and social activist has blazed a trail of goodwill, not just in Jamaica, but across the world. witness at that time her dedication and love for country as well as our desire to see better health care and indeed a better quality of life for all Jamaicans. Syringa Marshall Burnett's passion for health care began with a desire to go into nursing. As a teen, she was accepted into a training program at the Kingston Public Hospital. That sparked a career and a lifetime of learning that included midwife training at KPH, a Bachelor of Nursing degree from the University of Toronto, and a Master's degree in Adult Mental Health and Nursing Education from New York University. Upon her return home and from her various positions at the University of the West Indies, she would marshal her training and experience to help develop Jamaica's healthcare profile. Among other things, successfully advocating for a nursing degree program at the University of the West Indies and later a master's program at the UWI's School of Nursing. Head of the Department of Advanced Nursing Education, she successfully defended the retention of the department's status in the restructuring of the faculty in order to increase the number of young persons entering the nursing profession. Syringa Marshall Burnett was also integral to the establishment of an examination and licensing system for nurses in 1993. She served five times as president of the Nurses Association of Jamaica, was a member of the World Health Organization Expert Committee on Nursing, and served on the advisory boards of the American Journal of Nursing and the Journal of Advanced Nursing. In 1992, Syringa Marshall Burnett started another chapter of public service when she was appointed a seat in the Senate. Three years later, in 1995, she became the second woman to serve as president of the Jamaican Senate, a position she held and served with distinction until 2007. As a senator and later president of the Senate, she raised the bar of political decorum, parliamentary and political decorum, by the fine example she set, Mr. Speaker. Her parliamentary contributions were profound and her leadership fair and respected. She also served as a justice of the peace. Syringa Marshall Burnett's contributions in life did not go unnoticed. In 1990, she was awarded the Order of Distinction Commander Class. An academic center at the University of the West Indies was named in her honor. It's called the Syringa Marshall Burnett World Health Collaborating Center for Nursing and Midwifery Education. And until the time of her passing on October 3, 2014, Syringa Marshall Burnett was chair of the National Council for Senior Citizens. She is survived by her husband and daughter.